After eight years of free parking for motorcyclists, the city is thinking of putting on the brakes. A report by Transportation Services says that the city would make up to $250,000 a year by charging motorcyclists parking fees. And creating designated parking spots is the first step, making it more desirable for motorcyclists to park. Often they don't want to park in the midst of cars because they're afraid of getting knocked over, etc. So this will provide them safe places to park um, within pay and display areas, um, but designated for motorcycles. Ryerson offers motorcycle parking permits for a designated parking lot, but this isn't where most students park. Most students park here, beside the School of Image Arts, for free. And students like Jonathan Oliveira would consider other modes of transportation if the city changes the rules. That would be bad, because that's the reason why I bought a bike, actually, the main reason. Um, I'd probably take TDC to school. Lucky for Oliveira, the proposal needs to go through many steps before any changes to motorcycle parking are made. The proposal was adopted on Friday by the Public Works and Infrastructure Committee and will be considered by City Council on October 8th. For Ryersonian TV, I'm Amanda Klein.